welcome back to my channel my conchas it is your girl diane puro guanajuato's vlogs i'm here having dinner at one of my favorite ramen spots here in phoenix arizona and the name of this place is nora asian fresh fusion i cannot wait to show you guys exactly what it is that i get i mean i'm, I'm telling you this is one of my favorites i did want to try another uh, spot but we did drive out to one and it was so tiny. Estaba bien chiquito, it was so tiny, tiny. I would I'll probably be like trying to eat in there, yeah, no. As always, let's welcome all the new subscribers to the Concha Crew. If you have not yet subscribed, do me a favor. Yep, go to the right, hit that bell so you're notified every time that I go live and every time that I post. And if you guys can do me a favor right now, go ahead, hit that like button for me and drop me some comments. I love hearing from everybody. But you guys are gonna have to stay tuned to see exactly what it is that I get here. Again, this is one of my favorite ramen spots here in Phoenix, Arizona. So this is a spicy beef ramen. Look at that right there. Oh, wow. That looks delicious. I also asked for extra noodle and extra beef. Ariel as well, got the same as me. And then we got orders of, right here, these are the, the dumplings. And then she got, of course, um, the egg roll. Oh, these look so good. It smells so good. Oh, wow. Ya llegó la comida. The food has arrived. I'm ready. Let me go ahead and just start off as always. If you guys can please join me for my prayer. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. Please bless the hands that made this. Please provide a warm meal to someone else in need. Thank you again for the blessing of this meal. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So again, you guys probably already seen, I got the spicy beef ramen and it has egg in there. It has um, bam bamboo shoot. <laughs> Don't come for me. And it also has this cute little uh, pink thing. It's so cute. <laughs> Don't come for me. <laughs> and I also ordered a side, mm, my favorite of these dumplings. Look at that right there. Look at that. Give a bit. <laughs> Ariel, she got the same as me, except I ordered more noodles and more beef. She got a spicy beef ramen as well. And then she got her side as uh, egg roll. Egg roll. Yep, yep. Extra sauce. Mm -hmm. And with some extra sauce, because you know my boo is extra. <laughs> yes. So let's go ahead and let's dig in. I hope everybody is in, in great vibes. Again, I appreciate every one of you guys. I see you guys commenting. I see you guys watching my old videos. Thank you so much. I cannot appreciate any more. Mad love to my concha crew, my concha crew. Okay, so I'm just gonna go right into the noodles. You already know, that's what I came for. These noodles look so delicious. Ooh, and I'm looking for the beef because you know, I paid for the beef. Let's get some beef. There goes the beef right there. Ooh. So we got the beef right there. Mm. We're gonna add some noodles in here. And there may be a lot of slurpy noises, so if you do not like any type of slurping, and you know you eat with your mouth closed and you are very proper, I suggest you just hit that like button for me on the way out. Thank you. Mm. Mmm. 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 I want an egg. Who wants an egg right here? Look at this egg right here. Mmm. Right here. This is for my Lati. Lati loves to eat. I have been waiting for the egg forever, but this is for you. For my Lati loves to eat right here. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. I'm gonna say the flavor of the broth, huh? It gives it that. It's just, it has a lot of flavor. Oh, that's so good. Yes, it's that, that what would you describe the broth? Mm -hmm. You can taste the, the beef in the broth. Mm -hmm. I like that. It's very light, but it's flavorful. Mm -hmm. I agree. This is like, if I'm not feeling good and I'm a little bit sicky sick, I would come here. Yeah, I agree. It has, but you know, some are gonna ask, is it very spicy? It's mm -hmm. not that spicy. I mean, you gotta remember, I think, you know, to them, the spice is just a little kick, not like spice, spice, where you're like, 
you know, <laughs> have boogers coming down your face and stuff. Let's try these. Oh, I love these dumplings right here. Let's go. You want to try one, baby? Mm. I'll take one. I love me some fried dumplings. Mm. Mm -mm. I have to double check the shirt. <laughs> I have to double check. I had a double look at my shirt because, you know, I'll be making a mess. But I've always said, if it doesn't get on your face, it does not belong in that place. What do you think, babe? It is so good. I'm a broth person. And now, I, I mean, not just because it's getting, you know, cooler here in Arizona. Just in general. It could be hot. It could be 115 degrees. Yes. I love me some caldos. I love me some broth. Ooh. Wow. And of course, <coughs> Ooh, sorry. I'm over here saying, it's not that spicy, just a little kick. And I'm over here. <coughs> I had to apologize. It's just because the broth, when I slurped it, I took it in so fast. But um, I was mentioning that I love caldos all year round. And caldos, for those that don't speak Spanish, are soups. I'm a big time. Let me show you how big their, their, beef, thing, their beef is here. Look at that. Huge. Big old chunk of beef. Right to my mouth. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Let's get into these noodles. Then... Again, if you feel that I talk too much, then I'm gonna tell you, I think I'm not the one for you. Again, you can hit the like button and on to the next. I, I'm, I'm sorry, when I eat, I can't sit there and just be in silence. It doesn't work like that for me. So if you don't like talking, then I suggest, you know, you can find on YouTube, there's tons and hundreds and thousands of others that you know, they just you keep. Know what? Why would you be on YouTube if you don't want to hear people talk? Mm -hmm. That's all you have. <laughs> Go to an ASMR channel, mm -hmm. and it's a lot more noise there. Right? I never said, and I've never ever said that I do ASMR. Right now, these noodles probably <laughs> sound like it, <laughs> but this is probably the closest of ASMR, or when I go, mm, mm, or when I go. The only closest you guys are gonna get. Oh, here. Who wants this? Go ahead. Look at that. Oh, yes. Oh. Mmm. 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 Okay. Back to the dumplings. Babe, what did you think about the dumplings? They are so good, it's crispy, crispy mm -hmm. juicy inside. Yes, and they're, you, you may think that they're tiny. No, these right here are packed. Like, look at the little pancita. The little stomach's packed. Mm. I'm gonna go ahead and try my egg roll. I'm so ready for the holidays. I cannot wait. I'm putting up my Christmas tree tonight. She's set. Right. Bobby's set. So Okay, let's, let's give it a try. This is Ariel's egg roll. All right, let's go ahead and dunk it. Ooh, yes. Okay, let's give it. That is so good. Mmm, that's delicious. I mean, how would you say the flavor? It's, it's I want to say it's chicken, right? It's chicken, yeah. I can taste the cabbage yep. and all the vegetables. I can eat it like this just without the sauce, but I like my extra sauce. But I was saying, we're gonna put up our Christmas tree tonight and our decorations. Are you guys early on, on decorating? Or are you guys ones where you guys say, mm, we wait till after Thanksgiving? Comment below. I mean, I'm one of those where I'm ready. It's never too early for me. Mm. I love me some ramen. Whether it be this ramen, it'd be my my top ramen, you know, 
the one at the, the store for 39 cents. And I know you guys are gonna say, it has too much sodium, too much salt. I didn't say I eat it every day. I'm just saying I do love them. To my ramen, though not this one, but the ones I get at the store, I add, um, I add me some lemon in there. I add me a little bit of like salsa, which it either be chita bean or um, uh, salsa huichol. And I just hook it up. I mean, I even have I'm on here, if you guys are wondering, I even made um, a ramen recipe and it's so simple. Like I bought the ramen at the store and I added like shrimp and stuff. Go down to my older videos and it's called Diane's, Diane's Ghetto Ramen. <laughs> but it, I'm telling you, it's so good. Ghetto but delicious. Ghetto but delicious. Yup, and nutritious. <laughs> mm. Better. Look at it. I'm trying to give her my last one. I'll take half a bite, actually. And she said, no. Mm. No, she did finish that, that egg roll within seconds. Okay. Okay. So piece. look at this is a piece you left me. <laughs> look at <laughs> it. They don't laugh if you can't try your Chinese food. Mm. Oh. You know what I, I like about this um, this ramen here is the noodles. It's the noodles for me. The noodles you can tell are fresh. And I, and I have to mention that these noodles are made in-house. This is not, we bought frozen noodles and now we're gonna boil them and give them to everybody. No, fresh. And they cook them just right. Yes, it's just right. Like they're so good and they're soft and it's like creamy. Oh, and I love to do this. So I'm about to do this and then I'm gonna get this. Ready? That was a moment of silence. This is so good. I could just drink the broth alone. Oh, I got two of them. I got two pieces. Mm, that's the lottery right there. Let's go ahead. Oh, let me see if I could do this. It's gonna be a big bite, but I'm kind of scared if I can't. So if you see something that you don't want to see, exit right now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm -mm. I'm gonna drop the address to this place. Those that live here in Phoenix, it's really good. It's quiet in here. And the ambience is very open and clean. And you're like seated away because like I said, we try to um, go to some other place before this. <laughs> I was gonna I was like, okay, let's just do it. And then I tell her, I go, babe, she's like, mm. she tells the lady, no, we're not going to be able to. Why, babe? It's, tell my. Oh my gosh, it was so small. And it was packed, but oh my God. There's no leg room. It felt like you couldn't even walk to the front to place your order. It was legit. Like, like going through people. It was insane. Like, huh? When we walked in, you guys, literally, it's like a table with packed with people. We couldn't get past the doors. That's how packed it was. And the, and but it, it was really small. Not only that, the walkway, like, thank you, baby. You know my boo, she be, she be looking out for me. The walkway, like if we wanted to get to the back table and it's little, like two little, it's just a little small table, like two chairs. Literally, my nalgas, which are my back, would have been all up on everybody's table. And my, <laughs> my boo's too. And truthfully, they shouldn't allow that many people in the cold. Yeah. Like, they weren't really spaced off like they should have been. So I was like, yeah, not gonna happen. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I mean, they should have just, you know, made it a little bit more room. I know it's a small little place. I won't say their name, you know, because I'm not about doing that. But I'm just saying they should have just, you know, make it a little bit more space. I don't want to feel like literally right here on this little side is the next people next to me. So, oh, look at this is an egg right here. Look the egg oh my gosh oh let's get it mm. Mm. would you rate it babe i'll say 10 out of 10. yep 10 out of 10. and this is i've, I've had this just like i said 
I do orders to go. I really like that they have a spicy noodle option. They do have the regular ones, but. Yeah, talk about the menu. Baby, what do they have up there? They have some specialties up there, ramen and Asian specialty. It's like they have Ming, Mongolian beef, there's just so many options. We have sushi here. A lot to choose from. It's a fusion, so, yeah. and it's fresh, so it's freshly made. If you want one of those ramens, like I mentioned, where you just warm them up. Oh, I mean, have your poppers. Yep, I was saying, if you want Whip something salad. quick, <laughs> this is not the place for you, because they make this fresh. Um, but yeah, they have sushi as my babe was saying, jalapeno poppers. Have you ever had squid? Have you had squid before? Uh -uh. I don't know about that. I don't know about either, but they have some squid salad. Up there? Yeah. They have squid salad up there? I don't know. You know, I don't know. I, don't I mean, I'll try it. But they have different bowls. They have... This one's a spicy beef. They have um, a miso. It's like a spicy miso. Uh -huh. What name them all? We're trying to get the. She's over here at the side looking for us. So they have a vegetable ramen. A vegetable ramen for the vet, for the ones that are no meat. Miso spicy, ramen. Miso non spicy. Mm hmm. Oh my goodness. If I don't say it right, it's because I can't see right. <laughs> um, they got a seafood ramen. A seafood ramen. Fried rice chicken. Fried rice chicken. House fried rice. House fried rice. Chow, <laughs> chow mein chicken. Chow mein chicken. House chow mein chow mein chicken. As as yeah, we tried our hardest and no, we're not making fun of. It's all in good humor. But see, yeah, no. they have different bowls is what I'm saying. Mm. Sushi place. Ooh, they have boba tea. They even got boba tea. Sushi platters. Yeah. This is so good. We have a lot of here. You do. There's a lot of options. So if you don't want the spicy ramen, they have all this. And they even have the tr traditional ramen up there. What's the name of that traditional one, babe? Do you see that? There's like a traditional, um, what is it called? It's with a T. We can't pronounce it. Tonkatsu? I think so. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but they have the traditional ramen here, tonkatsu too. I wanna try that next. But look at, wait, look at, let me show you guys how big this garden is. Look at that, it's a big old chunk. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. 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 The broth. The broth. I was telling them, uh, we are big broth people. We can eat soups every day of the year. But I feel like broth is where you find all the flavor. If you you can't get the flavor right. Mm -hmm. The soup ain't gonna be right. That's how, like, I, when I say it, that's how you'll know if something's good. Try that broth. Yep. And it's that like will tell you. Yeah, like when you're making rice, Mexican rice. Mm -hmm. When you're making Mexican rice, you wanna try it. As you know, you're prepping it. Try that juice, the broth. If that broth is too salty, that means your whole rice is gonna be salty. Throw it away. Yep, don't even try. Don't try. But if. For me, it's hard to say because some people have asked me, when I make rice, can you tell me what are like the exact measurements? And it's hard, you guys, because us Mexicans, it's like, un poquito de esto, un poquito de esto. It's hard for <laughs> We kind of just go by what? The pitch and taste. You know, I, I'm pretty sure those can agree with me because I've asked, you know, like my, my grandma and, you know, family members, oh, can you tell me how you made that? And they'll say, oh, pues I did this, this, y luego le pongo un poquito de esto. It does not work. And I'm like, ¿cuánto es un poquito? Meaning, how much is un poquito? How much is a little bit? Uh-huh. Mm. 
All right, before I close off this vlog, I wanna go ahead and say one thing. Y'all about to hear the best slurping ever. So if you don't like that, cause this is my favorite. When I eat soups, I love to, to drink that juice. I like to get that slurp. So I'm giving you the choice to exit out now. Fast forward this, this two minutes Yes ma'am, here we go. You ready? ASMR. ASMR in full effect. <clears throat> okay, I'm satisfied. I'm sorry, I do that every time. Every time that I eat noodles, I have to just, I have to just chug that, that broth. I will say, um, they serve you a lot. Like these are big bowls. Yeah, these are. And Look at the bowls. Eat. They're huge. Yeah. That's a bowl right there. And they, and they serve it to, it to the, the top. top. Yeah. Yeah, so, all right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and exit out here. Thank you again for all the love and the support. I will see you guys on my next vlog. Adios.